We are Skyly Drive. You're watching Behind the Ink on, on pitcam.tv. Swing. So now we've convinced them to talk about their tattoos. Oh, geez. Yeah, here we go. Who wants to go first? All right. Um, I mean, I, I've never had to talk about tattoos really before. Well, then I'm just going to pick one out, and you're going to tell me the story behind it. I think I'm going to do the hand. Yeah, okay. Are we doing it right now? Yeah. Okay, so I was, I was four years old, or five years old, and I beat my first, my first like, difficult video, video game, and it was Legend of Zelda. And I've played every video game right when they come out ever since, like still to this day. So the main character has this triangle tattooed on his hand. So I, I thought it'd be pretty appropriate to get it done. And how old were you? When I got it done? Yeah. Uh, I just got it done this summer on Warp Tour. Oh. My friend Romeo did it from San Diego. Romeo. Rome. He'll Rome. see this. Yeah. <laughs> Plug. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. It's... it's and there's a new one coming out next month. I'm pretty excited, but Brian has my Wii in his room. I won't give it back. Yeah. So I don't know how I'm going to play it. I, I, it's my Wii. Yeah, but you have a PlayStation, so. Are you going to get it tattooed <laughs> on you, too? Um, I actually have I have a bunch of the same like things. I have them on my leg. I have a Kirby dressed as the character. Well, show us. Show us. I, I'd have to take my pants off. Okay, no, it's okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> take them off. No, dude. I'm not taking them off on pitcam.tv come on <laughs> your demise did that yeah <laughs> yeah they took off all their clothes oh well including their underwear no that was only well on. now we just be copying them yeah, yeah. Copying them. Let's be original. but i have four of them tattooed on me like the triforce thing one of them's kirby dressed up as a link like a little outfit and then i just have a bunch of these on my leg i'm obsessed i'm obsessed with it i, mean, I guess i'll pick another one out <clears throat> Let's see, do you just have your arms or? Yeah, I have like my leg and the neck and chest. Okay, yeah, let's talk about the neck. What is this one here with the, with the woman and the... the <laughs> okay, it's like, it's pretty much just a good versus evil thing. I have a vampire spitting out bats on this side. And then like this gypsy chick like fighting it with butterflies and the butterflies are winning. Uh, I it really, to me, it doesn't have any purpose or meaning behind it whatsoever. I just thought it was kind of cool. to. Do, I had an idea to do it. This one's a movie cover from a movie that I can't really remember the name of. I worked at Target and I saw the cover, so I took a picture of it. Uh, sleep walkers? Sleep walkers. Sleep no, it's... Day, day... Day walkers. Day, I, it's some horror movie with, like, vampires and werewolves, but it was a girl, and she wasn't spitting out bats. It was just her hair, like, blowing by. I don't know. I just thought it was cool. I, I don't regret it either, even though I'll never be able to get a normal job my whole life, but that's fine with me. What's normal these days, yeah, anyway? Yeah, exactly. Well said. Yeah. Do you have a favorite tattoo? Um, I don't know. Well, they're all my favorite, <clears throat> and like when I first get them, and then I get tired of it, and I want a new one, and that's my favorite. So it's just ongoing. And what's the newest one then? Um, it's your hand. My hand, yeah. Mm -hmm, for sure. For sure. For sure. And what does it say on your knuckles? Uh, the top says glorious, and the bottom says die young. It's not like they're, they go together. It's about like people dying before they should, being young and stuff like that. Yeah. Don't die on me, brother. I'm not trying to, man. Right. Dying has to suck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to pick out one more, and then we'll go to your arm. <clears throat> okay. Hmm. <laughs> um, this one. It's like a. Um, it was my. It's actually my first tattoo that I ever got. Uh, I had some friends pass away when I was like 17, so I got this in memory of them as two girls. So I got their faces tattooed on me. I thought it was appropriate for a first tattoo because it actually meant something. Yeah, it's also a logo for some band. I saw it in AP Magazine and I ripped it out, but I cannot remember what band it is. <laughs> two girls, it's probably like Tegan and Sarah or something like that. I'm not really sure. Maybe. I like to make funny faces with them and talk and like stretch their noses out and do weird shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's all. Okay. So, do you just have your arm? <laughs> just my arm and my lip. Oh, your lip. Then that's the first one I want to see. Uh, it's kind of faded right now, but... So it's Roxy. It's my puppy's name. I love you, Roxy. I can't She's... stand that 
She's she. Come on, shut up, dude. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's funny. Um, it's really the size of like a little mouse, pretty much. It's we rat. Were on, we were on tour with a band called Motionless and White, and their keyboardist, uh, his name is Balls, had his gear upstairs, and we literally got off stage and I went upstairs and I was like, "Do my lit, man." Really? Yeah, that was cool. He did it for me. But yeah, that's probably one of my favorite tattoos, even though it's almost gone. But I can always get it touched up. Yeah. Did it hurt? No, it didn't hurt. I had a few. I had a few drinks. It's kind of dangerous, like having ink just flow into your mouth everywhere. Probably is dangerous, but people do it all the time. So yeah, why not join them? You know, you know. But yeah, I got other ones too. I mean, you can take your pick. They all kind of flow together. Um. Saw something here. I'm gonna pick that. It looks like Zeus. Or it's like a Zeus. It's not supposed to actually be Zeus. It's just supposed to be like kind of a god figure, like controlling, like don't mess with God or anything like that, because he can just strike you down at any moment. There's like this Roman building thing that's like on fire. I thought it was really cool. It was a cool concept. And he was supposed to be in a chariot riding the seahorse, so he's supposed to be like a god underwater. I got the seahorse idea from Las Vegas, first time we were there, uh, I, I was just like blown away. I was like, oh, it's Las Vegas. I've always wanted to come here. And outside of Caesar's Palace, they have a bunch of statues. And I was like, that's so cool. That'd be so cool to get tattooed on me. And so that's like a memory in itself. Every time I look at that, I'll think of the first time I went to Las Vegas and lost all my money. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Did you get your arm done at once? Like, did you just think of a story and get it all done? Or was it like piece by piece? It was piece by piece. My first one was the skull and flower. It's kind of like a good and evil type thing, too. I was like 19 when I came up with it. I mean, kind of a weird concept. This one's probably one of my favorites, a clock. A, yeah, it's a lyric from a band called Five Minute Ride that was like the big local band in our area. And, uh, we all have five. Well, not all of us, but me and Nick have fives in the back of our arms. They, like, were everything we wanted to be at the time, like, growing up. Like, oh, they're playing, like, the local venues, like, the good local venues. and They were the first band that came out that I knew of in our area that's had, like, screaming and singing and stuff, too. It was all pop punk before that. Yeah. But, yeah, that's definitely a special one to me. And Maybe the, the latest one that you've added to your arm? Uh, the latest one is my elbow. It's just a little swirly thing. <laughs> it was just to complete the, the complete sleeve. the sleeve. I haven't been tattooed in like two years. It's been forever. I miss it. It's just I don't really want to go on my other arm. I kind of want to save one. <laughs> like, my mom would like that. I want to do my chest or something, but I heard that really hurts. So I'm gonna have to like pump myself up for that one. Yeah. yeah.